Um, That's sweet. Yeah, you won't find them in Australia. Uh, Madison Square Gardens. Yeah, see, they are. Madison Square Gardens, sorry. Madison Square, yeah. Yeah. They're yeah, awesome. Yeah. Pumas. And they're, that's like, and that, that they're a nice colourway as well. You doing these, Jamie? Yeah, they're cool. Thanks, mate. Yeah, they're good. good. I'll take them. Don't worry, I'll, I'll be your job for you. So I've got them, 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 and then those. All right. Pity? Yep. Let's do it. You got that? Yeah. Good man. That's a great boy. Oh, That's nice, isn't it? That's sick. Mm. Is it um, yeah, tagged uh, on the back? Yeah, Mitchell and Ness. Oh, Mitchell and Ness. Can I put that in? Oh. Oh, Luke. Woo. <laughs> well played. How much are the video games, mate? Um, $3, most of PS2 games. $3, yep. $5 on the PS4s. Yep. Do you want me to take yours? That's, That's Jamie's. It's got nothing in it, so that's your fresh one. Oh, lovely. Thank you very much. Look at the assistance here. Would you do, there's 11 there. Would you do 25? They're all PS2s. Uh, yeah. Yeah, go on. 25? Yeah. No worries. So changing. All good, mate. Appreciate that. Yeah. Cheers. That's really cool. It's not the full set of them, is it? That's the three of them. You got the three. Plus we got the couple of the bear pies. The bear pies. How much would you do for, for these three boxed ones? Uh, we worked it out. Um, 70 bucks. 70 each? Or 7 total? 70 total. Yeah. It's my twin right here, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's funny. Um, I'll, do, I'll do the 70, mate. Yeah, that's cool. Uh, I actually paid 70 for the three. Yeah? Um, you know they sell a bunch of those? Potentially 70 each. Yeah. Is that on Marketplace? Was it? No, I just bought it just then. Oh yeah, bro. Yeah. <laughs> do do your research on that, but uh, you may you may the have a perfect, buyer. The perfect one on that for you. You may have a buyer already. Yeah, no, you're right. That's all good. I'll help you move everything into that. This is yours, right? You're yeah. taking this, aren't you? So I'm going to put this in the front seat, all right, just for now. Is it right? Yeah. Um, also got these. No. Oh, the big ass one. Fine. Are these anybody? Yeah, I'll take, I'll take those. Yeah, that's alright though. Close five bucks. Yeah. You can have those two pieces. Appreciate that. There was a game that went with that, but that I wanted the money for. Oh, yeah, those. I thought that game went with that. Um, they normally tell you. See this. So it's that bigger gun. Oh, I did have it. I got rid of it. Ah, no <laughs> worries. So what have you got? So I got that, that, and that. I think that was what you were talking about, maybe. No, no I had another one like that. Oh. Um, Fifteen. Okay. And are these ones? And these ones you can have... Like you can have eight bucks for that. Eight bucks, a lot. So 23. I'll give you 25, hey? And, and no consoles today? Uh, no. No, no worries. Oh. Is that what? Is that the cameras? Oh, let's have a look. Can I just have a look at who which player it is? Yeah, sure. Hey, hold it up. Let me see it. That is so cool, man. XL2, that'll fit you perfectly. Well, yeah. That's, that's sick. This is good, Jamie. Yeah, so we like sort of added it up and I should be able to get like 750 to 800. So I just got, um, I just, yeah. 
Oh, no, I'm just going to pay out Easily um, done. Easily done. Yeah, good. Use that e-profit. So I think it was like 7 20 and it came out to like 6.30. So I yeah, so you'll... You'll, um, you'll do well there. This is the Thunderbirds, is it? Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. How much have you got on it? Um, look, I had 50, but I'll take 40. I'll take 40 on it? Yeah, in case it rains again. Yeah, I know, hey. Right? Do you know if it's, is there anything missing to it? No. It is nothing. complete? Yeah, it's complete. And even the little men in there, all the stickers are all there. Yeah, right. It's very cool. And yeah. you, you're right, you don't see Thunderbirds a yeah. hell of a lot. My son's 33. Yep. So that's how often. Yeah, gotcha. All right, guys, not a bad morning out in the flea market. A few goodies to uh, take you through here. The Ciccone running shoes. Have a look at the condition of these. I was blown away when I saw Joe pull these out. Um, Ciccone's a pretty good brand. Don't come across it too much. Uh, but these shoes have literally never been worn. They're the Fast Witch 5s. So I'm thinking about maybe $59.95 free postage on those ones there. Puma, I don't really buy Puma too heavily. But have a look at the condition of these as well. I, I could not be saying no to them. Only worn a couple of times. Maybe $40, $45, something like that for those ones there. These are an awesome pair of shoes, guys. They're a women's US size 8. Uh, but they're the Nike Internationalists. There they are there. Whenever I see these shoes, uh, I always convert them into about 60 bucks. Like the co uh, colorway of those as well. So that was good. And then these are pretty much an entry level Adidas um, Boston Zero. So maybe 40 there. Let's just say 60, 60, 40, 40. So 200 bucks worth of shoes right there. I don't know about this one here, guys. I paid 70 bucks for it. I've sold these a number of times in the past. I had a collection of five and they all sold pretty quick. So I ended up paying about an average price of $23 a piece. And there were comps on eBay, brand new condition for $200 plus postage. And then another one as well for a hundred bucks plus postage. So paid the $70. I don't know if that was a good move or a bad move. Let me know if you would have done that at 70 bucks in the comments below. And then we work on the video games. Now the first set of video games were these here. Remember I bought 11 games and I paid a total cost of just $25. It was more for the purpose of bundling them with a console. And I've got a number of games here. There's actually eight games that are around about less than sort of $10. So they're gonna go into a bundle. But these ones I was able to pull out to be worth a little bit of value. I think there's about 15 bucks in there, 15 in Gran Turismo 3, and then in Madagascar I can get about 20 bucks. So uh, these three games will pay for the purchase of $25. And then I've got some games left over for a video game bundle. I also I always like to buy the accessories as well. So when I saw the wheel uh, for Racerama, that will go for about $35, I believe, as will this one here as well with the two guns. Um, so I've got Chicken Blaster and then the two accessory guns as well. So um, a good sort of $60 in those two games there, and I didn't pay a lot to get my hands on them. And then these ones here as well. I think this one here was going for about $15. Bucks. Uh, Midnight Club 3, um, I think you can get about... 20 i think the comps will say on that one there and then paradise the ultimate box i should be able to get about 20 bucks for that one there as well so a couple of good games nothing too outrageous um the risky purchase of the day was this one right here and i still don't know until it sells if it was the best of buys so it probably wasn't my best ever flea market run. The weather is miserable. There were less vendors than normal, but geez, it is so much fun going out there and connecting with everybody that comes on a weekly basis. You've got the Vancouver Grizzlies hat that Jax was able to pick up for just the two bucks. I really want to buy that hat, Jax. If you're watching, I am still very interested. Um, Jamie obviously got the Madison Square Garden shoes, the Nikes, the Air Force Ones. They're sweet. If they're a genuine pair of shoes, they could be worth a whole lot of money. So it was cool to see him pick those up. And then Jalen as well, and he picked up the Atlanta Hawks jersey, size extra large, completely genuine. Uh, Dominic Wilkins, that was sweet. And he only paid the $15. So even if I'm not picking them up, I still love to see what everybody else gets. It's just so much fun going down to the flea. And hopefully I can bring you not only my finds, but everybody else's finds as well in these videos every single Sunday. Consider hitting the subscribe button, guys, if you haven't done so yet. I had a much better flea market run a couple of Sundays ago that I'm gonna link for you right here. So hopefully you can enjoy that one. Appreciate you being here for this. We'll see you on Tuesday.